What is up Sprites, welcome to the Retro Rescue. My name is Austin and I am wearing my own merch. This time, unlike last time, this time it's hashtag blame streak all the way. Who knows, that's what this channel ends up being about. The mistakes that are made and the fact that I'm usually blaming you or someone else for it. But hey, that's only because we're friends. At least I hope so. Anyway, but you're here not for that kind of mushy stuff. You're here for the haul. What do we get? Not huge, but some fairly nice games in here though so hope you're having a good day let's start with star wars lethal alliance yes yeah, so we're going to play this twee league mercenary and we're going to go on a third person bang and shoot and slasher and have a bit of a fun game i did not know this one existed but it's unfortunate that it's an, a ubisoft game but hopefully it's not going to be as bad as all that so you can see where it is all up in there we'll leave those ones till last Leave that one till last. I have been sufficiently recommended this game by Gundam Russ, Borderlands. Uh, he was playing Borderlands, uh, I think, he might have been playing this actual version uh, not long ago, actually, probably a month or two ago um, at the time of filming this, um, or at the time you're seeing this, sorry. But um, he suggested I really should get hold of it, so I did. Now, this one here I have no idea about, but it looked interesting anyway. Black Sight. So it looks like a kind of a third person adventure, so, um, but it's a shooter, so, you know, why not? But it looks really good. Um, I don't know why, but, you know, it's Midway, so, you know, they've done some good stuff. They worked on the uh, Doom um, port for the PlayStation 1 back in the day. Sorry, PlayStation. I don't say PlayStation 1. That's almost a different thing altogether. But anyway, now this one I really know nothing about. Divinity 2. Ego... Draconias, I think that says. So it just looked interesting. I don't know why, but I get the yeah. feeling that someone's going to know something about that and be able to tell me whether it's any good or not. So uh, I'm moving over that side, and I've got to be careful that I don't block off that little screen. I was going to have to make it a lot smaller, aren't I? I but see you yeah, it just looked really fire. interesting, that you know. And just, proceed. you know, I don't normally go by back screenshots. I usually go for a game that I know, but this one doesn't. So I'm going to look forward to doing this one. Now, here we go. These two I got together on the same day, obviously, therefore they're in the same hall. Fear Effect on the PlayStation. I've heard the name before. It's a four disc, so it must be massive. I have no idea anything about it, but I'm really enjoying playing games that I have not played before. But not only am I going to get to try Fear Effect, which I guess is going to keep me busy for quite some time, I'm going to get to continue it with Fear Effect 2. Oh, so happy but they do look brilliant. I mean, they are only one player, which is the only problem, I would say. I mean, they come up quite late in the uh, in the cycle, 2165 um, in, in the release cycle. 3386, wow. So that's over a thousand games later, number two. So, you know, definitely looking forward to those. And the best part about them, IDOS, you know, and, and that's that. That's the main reason why I bought them. That was the draw to them. I'd heard something, but I didn't know. I didn't hear it was bad stuff. So I figured, got to be worth a go because people are obviously saying something about it, whether it's good, bad, or indifferent. I'll make my own, up, my own opinion up. Make up, make, make, make up my own opinion. That's what do we do? Because that's what we do because we're British. Yes. So there we go. Very, very small. I'm trying to keep them condensed, you know, because I don't want people sitting around for more than 10 minutes where I can on a haul. Just go through them, show a bit of footage whether it be somewhere along here, and then move on. All the main meat, everything that's going other than here, is all on the streams. So don't forget to like, share, subscribe, join me on the streams, visit the merch store if you want to support the channel, you know, and get yourself, not this because it doesn't exist anymore, but I've got one, and a few other people have got them too. New Blame Streak stuff on the way, and in the head, ready to do something with at most of the time we can. So anyway, I'll catch you later. Thanks for watching. Until next time, stay in the game.